we think about the word menopause, what does it mean? You know, if there's one thing I could do in my medical career, it would be to get rid of that word, because it's just nonsensical, really. Some man in some ivory tower decided it was when our period stopped, with a caveat, it has to be for a year. So what happens when it's a leap year? He didn't think of that, did he? But also, what happens if a woman has had a hysterectomy and doesn't have a womb? She won't have periods. Does she not become menopausal? He didn't consider that either. But if we're only thinking about menopause, what about me when I was perimenopausal? I was still having periods, but they were irregular. Was I supposed to wait until my period stopped and then wait a year and then go and seek help? That just doesn't make sense. But if we're only thinking about menopause and perimenopause, what about times of other hormonal change, such as when women have PMS, premenstrual syndrome, or PMDD, premenstrual dysphoric disorder, or even postnatal depression after having a baby? These are all times of hormonal change. So it doesn't really matter the label. What we have to be thinking about is what's going on in our bodies.